Hello, welcome back to Magat Health Solutions. Today we're cooking chicken afritada. Our ingredients are we've got garlic and onion, we've got some green peas, we've got some olives, we've got potatoes, carrots, red and green bell peppers, and we've got uh, one whole chicken chopped into pieces. And um, we're going to flavor it with our afritada mix. Um, if you don't have this at home, you can do your own mix using um, ketchup and soy sauce and some pepper to taste. Okay, we're going to use our multi-purpose 5 MP5 electric all-core roaster. Okay, so it's a 5-quart version of our electric all-core skillet and it has exactly the same 5 purposes. So you can use it as an oven, a griller, a fryer, a rice cooker because it's got two rice settings and you can do your slow cooking because it's got a temperature control there and a timer. Okay, so what we've done, we've preheated our MP5 to 230 degrees Celsius and it's just about ready now to use. So we've got our chicken and we're just going to brown our chicken and as you can see, I haven't used any oil at all. Okay, so just browning the chicken straight in there where you've preheated your MP5. And what I do, I just sort of make the chicken pieces, all of the chicken pieces touch either the bottom or the side of the MP5 just so it gets some heat into it. And I then leave it for a couple of minutes. Done. Okay, we're now going to check on our chicken. And as you can see, it's nicely browned and not fully cooked yet, but you're just browning the meat. Okay. We're now going to put in our onion and garlic. And I just like at this point to just make sure they're all mixed in together with the meat. We're not really going to be sautéing it so that we don't have any oxidation to the um, onions and the garlic but we just quickly give it a stir and then we put in all the um, potatoes, carrots, bell pepper, all our olives, some soy sauce and some lemon juice and then I always like a bit of black pepper to taste. You can add some more later if you want. So everything is inside. I'm now going to drop the temperature from 230 down to medium around about 130 degrees because we've already got all our vegetables in there and we're just going to wait for the vapor valve to click and then turn it even lower and wait for the vegetables to soften. The chicken will be more, uh, more or less done 
um, by now anyway because we've already browned it. So by the time the vegetables are ready and cooked, then everything else, the chicken, is cooked as well. Um, and we'll just wait for it to be served. Okay? Okay, let's check our chicken apritada. You can see all the vegetables retain their color and their shape. And this is now ready to serve once we've given it a good mix. So you can just serve this with on a bed of rice and enjoy it. <laughs>